Hello, good day everyone. Okay, in today's video, I'll be showing you how to install the Ubuntu on your virtual box without any hassle. Okay, so let's kick into the video. Okay, from the video, you can see this is my virtual box. Let me zoom in. This is my virtual box. Once you launch your virtual box, this is what you see on your system. Okay, so as you can see, I've installed the. I've, I'm trying to get the Ubuntu installed. Okay, normally, once you try and configure your Ubuntu, this is what you see on your screen. So once you go to the settings tab, okay, let's see the settings. And you go to the system settings, you go to your acceleration, you will see that the hardware virtualization is enabled. And if you check properly, you won't be able to click the OK button after you've done your settings due to this error message. The error message here is the hardware virtualization is enabled in the acceleration section of the system page although it is not supported by the old system it should be disabled in order to start the virtual system and if you try to if you try disabling it you will still be able to press the ok button the ok button won't be available for you to press okay the solution to this is to check if your system supports the virtualization hardware acceleration and you can do that from your bios okay so if your system supports it fine you should enable it if your system do not support it okay if you want to check if your system supports it all you need to do is to go to your Tax manager, you can the shortcut for tax manager is Control Shift Escape. Control Shift Escape should launch your tax manager, and from your tax manager, you go to performance. You know, once you open your tax manager, the first thing you see is processes. So, all you need to do, to do is to go to your performance okay from your performance you will see from the virtualization if your system supports virtualization or not as you can see my system does not support the virtualization because the pc i'm using for this video right now is hp compact 6720s okay it's not compatible with the virtualization method okay so what you need to do to to, to run ubuntu on your, on your virtual box is to launch your command prompt okay the shortcut for command prompt is cmd okay you launch your command prompt okay from your command prompt all you need to do is to navigate to where you installed your virtual machine okay let's go to my pc okay from pc let's go to local disk from local disk program files from program files oracle from oracle virtual box okay all you need to do is to locate this folder in your virtual machine called the vm manage box okay vm 
box manage okay this is the program we need okay once you can see v box manage that is the program you need to to change and to change the program you need to run it on your command prompt so all you need to do is to copy copy the address the location address you right click yeah okay let's copy the location address select all control c okay after you you might have copied the location address so all you need to do is to right click everything control a control c after you might have copied the address you go to your command prompt okay from your command prompt you type c d then you leave a space you paste what you copied so that the location of your command prompt will be directed to the folder you installed your virtual box okay so the command prompt is in the location of your virtual box now okay so all you need to do is to copy this command i will paste the command in the description below okay so copy the copy the command here the command is vbox manage the program i showed you the other time modify vm okay the sssss is your windows name you need to replace the sss the five sss in this code with your windows name i will show you now although i will show you now iphone iphone hw virtual x then you off the virtualization okay let me show you the f s s s from my settings here okay this is the sss i was referring to in the coding okay in the yes so this is the sss i referred to so all you need to do is to change sss sss to that maybe your ubuntu 20 20 04 so let's click the sss also to check the settings this is the i'm on the sss now so once i go to settings from the sss you can see uh, the same error message here if i go to advanced if i go to system acceleration you can see the acceleration is enabled so all, all i need to do is to go to my command prompt which i've opened then paste the code okay i've not copied the code let's go to and control c then i copy it control v okay i press enter all you need to do is to wait you see that the code is no longer there again all you need to do is just to go to your virtual box you quit your virtual box quit everything and restart your virtual box and the code you run will be activated on it so let's go to sss you are on the sss now so let's go to settings From settings I go to system from system I go to acceleration and you can see it has been deactivated okay and also the error message is no longer there again and also you'll be able to click your ok in the please do well to like this video subscribe for more informative video and also you can watch other videos on my channel 
leave a comment and if you're having difficulties you can